Hello and welcome to another video. We're standing here in the Lumbridge Castle next to the chef that we've helped, but there's somebody new to help. This lady right here, Patty Sear. Oh no, what do I do? It's all gone wrong. What's wrong? I'm supposed to be cooking a cake for the cake off, but my prize tin has broken. What's the cake off? Oh, you don't know about the Great Gillinor Cake Off? It's Party Pete's newest idea. He's invited representatives from across the world to have their baking skills judged. I would lose. Your prize tin. Yes, I use it for every cake I bake. It brings me luck. What happened to it? I'm not sure how, but it's broken in two. Do you think you might be able to help me? Start the 2023 birthday event. And that's what we're here for. I'm sure I can find someone to fix it. Patty hands you the broken cake tin. Alright. What about Bob? Do you think he can fix it? He does repair armor. Yes, I imagine he can. Not to mention he owes me one. Take this to him. It should cover the cost of the repair. You should be able to find him in his shop to the south. Uh, Alright. Let's go to Bob. Uh, let's do the birthday event. Could you fix this tin for me? I could. It will be expensive though. For a freaking tin? The cut mentioned you owed him a favor. I'd hope he had forgotten that by now. He gave me this note and said it would cover the cost. Yes, that should do it. Hand the tin over then. You hammered a broken half tin. He hammered a broken and half tin to fix it. Good as new. Yeah, there must be something great about the Lumbridge tin. You can hammer it to fix it when it's broken in half. Back to the castle. Was Bob able to repair the tin? Yes, he did it without too much trouble. You hand the tin over, blah blah blah. Oh, it looks brand new. There's no hammer dings? Now is there a chance you can help me find my hat? You want me to go kill some goblins or something? My lucky hat, it was up and it is a goblin. I swear I didn't read a guide or anything. It can it can't have gotten far by now. I would blah 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 chase it down and find out, of course. Try near the general store. There's a lot of goblins over there. Come here, goblin. You are dead. Oh, you know what? I think it's that one. Yeah. It's that one. What was your name? Warm Hands. Well, you are by a fire, I guess. Hello there. That's a nice hat. And Goblin Mail. I want to wear black Goblin Mail. You can't even make that in Goblin Diplomacy. It is your cooking hat. Are you sure? Where did you get it? I found it in the castle. <laughs> yeah, found it. I need to return it. Without hat, I not chef. Watch for 10 years how to cook in castle. Now my turn. I may have an idea. Why don't you go and talk to Patty Sear in the castle? You think she could help? Yes, of course. She learns everything, blah, blah, blah. The goblin stares. Things like food and drinks. She learns from me. Okay. Cutscene? No. Okay. Back to the castle. So you're the one that took my hat. Yes. Need it to be chef. You need it to be chef. That's absurd. No. Chef hat. Always. 
Well, I suppose I can let you keep the hat. It's always brought me luck. I keep lucky warm hands. Of course. You know what every chef does need to do? Cook a cake. <laughs> no, wear a hat. Well, yes, but what else? Cook. Warm hands can indeed cook. They're talking about baking a cake. I wouldn't want to try a goblin cake. Probably have like rocks in it. Or burnt meat something. Significant amount of mess and noise. Wow, that looks incredible. I learned 10 years from watching Cook. You have clearly learned a lot. Watching not good like doing. So Invader Taz, finally I'm a part of this quest. What do you think? The cake the two have baked. This is a good looking cake. Is there any rocks in it? I think so. Oh great. You want me to take your cake for you to Falador? Okay. I'd be happy to. Yeah, sure. I was just gonna go to the bank and get some rooms, but that's better. You teleport me right there. I'll get you as close as possible. And precise. Am I gonna be in the mining guild? Alright. That was pretty precise. What's up, party Pete? Pete, I have a lumberage's entry to the cake off. Oh, that's perfect. Just in time for all the rocks. Great, and don't mind the goblin. They're one of the chefs. Now there's a couple of things you need to know about the cake. There's rocks in it. Was anything inedible baked into it? Rocks. Secondly, may I hold on to it until the judging is over? Sure, but don't eat the rocks. Now then, I could use your help with sorting out a slight problem. I didn't come here to help you. Everlasting candle, I can't get it to light. Well, that's certainly one way to make it last forever. Ask him what the problem is. He's the wizard, not me. Pete says you're having trouble lighting a candle. Noob. Just a little trouble, nothing to worry yourself with. The candle is quite important. I've tried everything and it just won't light. Did you try a tinder box? <laughs> oh, why is that? She had an unfortunate incident a while back. What happens if you haven't completed Dragon Slayer 1 by the time you do this? Absolutely. Is there anything else I can help you with? There is. Great. Could you check that all the cakes are ready for judging? Of course. Do I uh, do that? Um, do I just talk to these guys? No. Um, are they upstairs? Wait, wait, wait. I have reinvented. Very 
proud of this, even if it accidentally rolled back into the oven. That's, that's what would be my cake. And it would be entirely burnt. It seems perfectly edible. General Bent Nose. Big high war guy, I'd say so. Yeah, sure, okay. Be green, green good. Thurgo. Is it a red berry pie? It's a red berry pie. It's a red berry pie. Have you ever eaten one before? No, I gave you both of them. Does that count as checking to see if they're done? Okay, it does not. Everyone to the inaugural Great Gillinord Cook-Off. The cakes are ready, and I hope you are too, Scarry Net viewers. We've got five cakes to judge today, so let's get right into it. First up, we have Thurgo and his Encando Dwarf Cake. Or, is it more of a pie? It is definitely a pie, but it is delicious. I'm glad you like it. I can give you the recipe if you want. That's very kind, but could it have not been a cake? No, it's important that it remains a pie. Next up, the Goblin Cake from Bent Nose and Wart Face. On first appearances, it looks good, rich, and chocolatey. Hmm, that doesn't taste like chocolate. What is it? It's poop. Oh, it's mud. Okay, mud works. Mud? Mud. Mud, mud, mud. Okay, moving on swiftly to... The loud beating of wings can be heard over Pete's voice. Elvar, you're supposed to be dead. The scary orb is... Do I have to kill a freaking dragon now? He's leaving at the audio feed of the event. Was there audio in this? I have my volume off. The sounds of dragonfire can be heard over Pete's microphone. I think it's over. Can we get the orb back up? I think we're back. Well, folks, that was an unexpected interruption to our show today. Unfortunately, we're going to have to cut things short to clean up. Before we go, though, I'd like to give a massive thanks to everyone who helped get us here today. Until next time, this has been the great Gillenor Cake Off. The hell? You didn't even taste my cake, bro. Well, I guess it wasn't my cake. Can't believe the dragon's invitation reached him. I didn't think you were serious about inviting them. Of course I was serious. I wanted to bring them a cake. Well, I don't think anyone was hurt, at least. And the candle, it's lit. So it is. It was nice of... Alvarg to come in Elvarg's place. Okay, Dragon Slayer 3, here I come, Alvarg. Alvarg. I did wonder which one of them would turn up, considering Elvarg's condition. Wink, wink. Hmm. Oh, don't worry. Where is this? Where does this leave the competition? Competition. I cannot talk. Hmm. Roald's cake was burned, and the gnome's child cookies are well. They're cookies. And the Lumbridge cake. 
Oh, I had that held safely away from the others. I'll give it a try now. Why didn't he get to chill with his cake like everybody else? Is you racist to black goblin male? Pete carefully tries part of the lumber's cake. What do you think? It's not made of mud, it's not burned, and it is a good cake. So does this mean it's the winner? Indeed it does. Congratulations. Warm hands will be pleased to hear that. I just want my rewards. Good news? You won. Your cake was the best. This means I am chef now? Bro, you were chef before. Is a reward? I'm not sure. Let's go ask Pete. Come on, bro. Let go. Warm hands is happy with the outcome. I'm glad to hear that. What? Oh, well, after that cake, it probably doesn't matter as long as they keep baking from now on. And of course, as part of the winning team, you should be rewarded. Yay! Happy 10th birthday, old school RuneScape. And thank you, Jagex, for making this game. Let's check out these rewards. Alright. We got the dragon candle. We got the Bob the Cat slippers. Can I change them while wearing them? I can. And the Jad slippers. I like, I like. I really like kitty cats. And then we got the birthday hat. Does that change? No. And no. We got a party hat. A silver party hat. That's new. Is that tradable? No, it is not. Very nice. We got the backpack. Doesn't it change? No, it doesn't. The jumper does. You said like what? Seven styles? I changed it. It doesn't look like I changed it. Yeah, no. Maybe this is blocking it. Yeah, it's not changing. I don't know. And then we have the plushie, the gnome child, a doggo, and a jad. I, I like the jad and the doggo. I like the doggo. The jad's dope. And then we have the cape. 10 years of old school RuneScape. And then we got a balloon. What's this? Half full wine jug. Alright. Well, that is the birthday event. Oh, this. You get to see this. There you go. A clan member has completed Watchtower and a thousand total level. Congratulations. Well, thank you and have a great day. Oh man, what a great party. Some good cake, some good pie. What? Who, who's that over there in the distance? Who is? No, it can't be. Is it really? It is. It's Iron Rectum. Iron Rectum, what are you doing here? This is my video. You had Christmas. Well, I know you. this is your video, but shoot, something big done happened between us. What? What could happen between us? We're a completely different series. I know that, and I'm free to play right now, but this affects both of us. Oh, really? What's that? Well, it's something like this. If you like to have good energy, and you like to have jitter-free energy, 
and you don't like to crash after you have that energy and let's just say by some weird chance you don't like sugar you don't like dyes or artificial colorings well have i got the drink for you starting today if you use my code at w.gg you can get 10 percent off from your whole order there will be a link in this video and every other video from here on out so you can get your 10% off today. Be sure to order. Rectum, I guess you were right. That is pretty big news. So, please go ahead and order today. If you feel like it, there's no pressure. But, I do highly suggest checking out W Energy. And thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you in the next. Bye now. I'll see you later. And you stop crashing my videos. I don't crash yours.